Well, I, I have so many things I want to talk to you about, but first of all, you might have very slightly beaten me on how many photos we post of our dogs on Instagram. Oh my God, really? What kind of dog do you have? I have a multi foo but your oh. dog, your whole feet is your dog. I know, it's embarrassing. But I don't care because he's, <laughs> like, I love him so much and he's so photogenic. I he's think it's ridiculous. What is he? He's a Labradoodle. Oh my God. But a mini, but he's like a good medium size. I feel yeah. like it's like your baby. A hundred percent, he's my baby. Do you bring him to set? Does he have a I nanny? Do. Is he in the trailer? <laughs> yes, all, yeah. I bring him to set when I can, if it's not too busy and I have time to like go walk him. But otherwise, yeah, he has like a dog walker that comes twice a day because I'm insane and like I just love him so much that I want him to be happy. I love that. Yeah, I birthed him, so uh, the least I could do is give him a walk. <laughs> Well, so is he born in the U.S.? No, he's Canadian. He is Canadian too. <laughs> he is from Ottawa, Ontario. Uh, originally from Australia, I imagine. But I love it. yeah. Okay. Well, I would just love to hear from you. I know you've been on a lot of fan favorite shows, but also you have a new one coming out. Can you tell us a little bit about Slumber? Uh, yeah, Slumber is this uh, like uh, indie sci-fi thriller. Um, it's so interesting and cool. It, they describe it as um, um, a female driven one flew over the cuckoo's nest and Jacob's ladder. I like the female driven part. Totally, oh, totally. Like because I know you have Darby yeah. from Scandal, and yeah. then there's another, there's a third. Who Emily is? Bett Rickards from so Arrow. You guys play some like badass woman characters on this show? Yeah, I play, um, the whole thing sort of takes place in an, as in an asylum, and I play. Like the no, I play the the doctor of the whole oh, asylum. Yeah, okay. so it's a different kind of it's a different role for me, but it's really cool and it's very kind of it's riding the line between helpful and evil. <laughs> so it's, it was fun. I'm looking forward to that. Yeah, it's yeah, yeah. It's okay, and also since it's Canada Day, can you just share like three of your most favorite things about growing up in Canada, Canadian food, like what just stands out the most is your favorite part about Canada? Um, I, you know, the people there, I'm from Montreal, it's the, they're the like most interesting, strange, sweet, loving, snobby, <laughs> like they're, they're, strange and snobby. It's, it's all like, it's a mix of the most like amazing cultures and it, it just makes for like a really great creative interesting person like I'm one of them what so. is your favorite food from Canada uh, I mean I gotta say poutine probably ah, so like, good classic. fries and gravy how can you go wrong it's it's just the best so good. yeah well thank you so much nice to meet you and happy Canada day congrats thank on the you. new show Slumpers. thank you it's a movie oh it's a movie yeah. it's a movie yeah Ah. It'll be out, I think, later this year, but yeah. Amazing. It's a movie. Well, thank you so much. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too.